A group of Detroit moms gathered today on the city's east side to raise concerns about plans to expand a hazardous waste facility. Freeman reports these women woke up early to make sure their voices were heard. Instead of breakfast in bed or brunch on this Mother's Day, a handful of parents are protesting on the east side. I'm beyond angry, terribly concerned for my family and my community and the people that live here. These protesters want to stop the dumping of hazardous waste into the water system. I, I was born and raised on Georgia Street, right down the street. I have an urban farm and um, I, I help feed people and I'm concerned that it, it could affect the food that I grow. What do you want? Deny the permit! What do you want it now? They plan to protest for 12 hours straight this Mother's Day, and they came prepared. The group stood at the corner of Georgia and Mount Elliott. Protesters say nearby factories want to increase the amount of waste that can be dumped into the water. The Michigan Department of Environmental Quality is reviewing the request. I think at this point in time, MDEQ is choosing which side they're on. I think they did it in Flint, and um, they're trying to do it here. We are the real people of the I-94 expansion, and they do not want to recognize us. Our homes are destroyed. Our neighborhood is dead. They say fracking produces hazardous waste. Fracking involves the hydraulic fracturing of rocks deep in the ground to extract oil and gas. Protesters say they're worried more frack waste could end up in the water. So this is just the beginning. We're absolutely not going to stop. We're not going to allow them to expand. Um, we put our bodies on the line for it. And this group is planning a larger protest on May 26 outside the MDEQ building in Detroit. Reporting from the east side, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4.